Hi guys, it's Taylor. So today I have such an exciting video pl planned for you guys. I mean, I kind of already did it, so yeah, but it's exciting. By the title, you can obviously tell that I will be recreating Timothy Chalamet's Instagram pictures. I love Timothy Chalamet. He's one of my favorite actors and his Instagram really doesn't have a lot of pictures. Um, so I think a couple of these actually aren't on his Instagram. But yeah, I love him so much, so I was like, you know what, might as well just recreate his. Before I show you the pictures that we took, I just wanted to give a big shout out to my sister, who was the photographer for this entire thing, and let me tell you, she needed to have some patience, because I'm such a perfectionist that it took like forever to get every single picture. So thank you, Georgie, and she also edited some of the pictures, so thank you for that too. And thank you to my brother for being a stand-in in one of the pictures. I know he really did not want to, but nonetheless, he did. So thank you, Trevor. So yeah, let's get into the pictures. I'm so excited to show you guys them because I think they came out really, really good. So this is the first picture. I'll put it like over there somewhere that I recreated. I really like this picture because I think it was from his GQ photo shoot. And I just thought it was really different. So I kind of wanted to give it a go and see what would happen. So this is what happened. <laughs> so the first picture that we are going to film is this one. I'll put it right here. Georgie just turned me into Timothy Chalamet with my makeup. So she like made my eyebrows darker, my nose. She like contoured it a little bit because he's a really tiny nose. And I just like made my lips kind of the same shape. Luckily, like my features are kind of similar, so it wasn't too hard. We have our bathtub. And I have like all the clothes that I need. So I'm gonna now when your right one goes down, your left one goes yeah, like, yeah, like that, like that. <laughs> That was the most uncomfortable position ever. I don't know how we even took that picture, but I think we, I think we got it. Pictures. So this is the final picture. I'll put them like side by side so you can compare them and see how much they look like each other. This picture was actually probably the easiest to recreate just because I had the background. It was just a bathtub. So the background was perfect and I had like very similar clothes and like a very similar pose. I feel like everything just kind of worked together in this picture, um, which was not the case for some of the others, as you will see later. The only thing that I have to say is that the orange filter was so hard to get on the picture. I don't know why, but like they must have had an orange light or something or just had like better editors. I don't know. I'd probably rate this picture a, honestly, probably like an 8.5 8 slash 9 because I don't know which one to rate it. I, I really like this picture. I think it came out really good and I'm very proud of it. So yes, 8.5 slash 9. This is the second picture that we tried to recreate. I really love this picture and I thought that this one was going to be pretty easy because this is the jacket that I actually wore in the picture and I thought it was just like perfect. Like I literally had the perfect turtleneck, the perfect jacket, the perfect necklaces, but this one was actually one of the hardest ones to shoot. So you guys will see in the vlog. Our next picture is going to be this one. Um, I like gelled my hair and everything. So I'm just going to like pin it up and like put it back and then just find like a blank wall like the one behind me and take the photo. Um, so yeah. Like your head needs to be like straight, but like also to the side. So we just finished the photo of the denim jacket picture and it's actually like the hardest one to film because it's like all about the face angle and stuff like that. But we'll see what it comes out like when we edit them. So after many, many minutes of hard work and frustration, <laughs> this is the end result. Overall, I think it came out okay. Like it definitely doesn't look as intense as his and like the collar, I put it, put the wrong side up. I should have put like the other side up so that was kind of annoying um but i think our outfits look pretty similar and the editing my sister did it looks pretty good it was just hard because that i don't have that jawline that he has and that was what i needed and his hair and basically everything about him 
but nonetheless it was okay i would probably give this picture a six out of ten just because it wasn't my favorite but i think it did end up turning out like pretty similar in the end so the third picture that i tried to recreate was this one over here i wanted to do this one just because it was a little bit more like chill and relaxed and not as like high production as the other one so i thought it would be like kind of easier and just a different vibe i guess and this is how we ended up doing that one so this is the next one that we're doing um again i think it's gonna be pretty easy but we'll see uh, I need a mustache in this one yeah i'm not doing that <laughs> Okay, so we got the next outfit on. It's just a, this is my sister. It's an LA Dodgers baseball cap that's black. And then I like try to make my hair look like a guy's. I think it worked. And then I just have a black hoodie on that I borrowed from my brother. I think that's the look. I think that's what we're going for. <laughs> one of my favorite ones to shoot because it was such a weird angle and it was always it was nice to have my brother in the background it was kind of fun to do I thought so this is the final product this is the picture that uh, we got and I actually really really like this one I don't I don't think it's exactly the same as his especially because the background's not the same and like his hat is angled forward and for some reason we could not get my hat to look like that I don't know if he just like has a different shaped hat or whatever, but it was very, very hard to get like the certain um, angle. So I would give this one probably a an eight out of 10 just because it is one of my favorites and I just like liked shooting it and how it came out. So yeah, definitely an eight out of 10 for this one. Finally, this is the last picture that we tried to recreate. Um, I, again, just thought that this picture was really cool and like not something I would ever take so I thought it would be kind of cool to try and like translate it over especially since he's a guy and he's shirtless and I just I don't know I want to accept the challenge on this one so this is what happened with that all right so we're working on taking the fourth picture I made like this cardboard cutout on my window so that it would reflect kind of like that on my bed because if you look in the picture it's kind of like this not exactly but like close enough so we have to take it super fast before the sun goes in. I tried to do my makeup this morning. I like curled my hair a little bit. And then I just found like this white tank top. Except I have to like Photoshop this design off. But overall I think it should be good. So we'll try and get the pick. I guess we like more downward but like also like foot sideways. final picture for that one and again I think it came out okay like it came out a lot better than I expected especially after like you edited it it made the picture look a lot better so I was kind of surprised by this one um and I think it looks like pretty similar to his so I'm gonna give this probably a 7.5 just because I think like my body's in the right position and it's like kind of the same angle I think my head had to go like a little bit more to the left which was the only thing bugging me um but yeah I think it was a really cool picture obviously my bed sheets were the same but you know what can you do I got close enough it's like gray and gray so like whatever <laughs> so that was all my pictures I took um, I really hope you guys enjoyed them and let me know in the comments if you think that they were similar or if you well, hopefully you didn't hate them because I really like them, so that would suck. But yeah, let me know in the comments what you thought about them. I'll put all the pictures up on the screen over here one last time just so you can see how amazing they really are. <laughs> and make sure to like this video if you liked it. So yeah, go watch more of my videos and subscribe over here. Or is it over here? I think it's over here. Maybe. I think the button's like right there. So yes, yeah, subscribe, watch more videos, and I will see you guys very soon. Bye!